That done build, man. Just fresh off the hot plate there, Roger. Alright, buddy, Mr. Gatekeeper said appreciate bumping it down with me on the flat side with this old cereal about six foot off the ground. And uh, letting me know this one 1446 driver I just got done putting together, man's working. Appreciate it, my friend, Mr. Gatekeeper, with this one pill gatekeeper built driver. We're gone. Heck yeah. Man, that thing is cool as a cucumber. Alrighty, well. <clears throat> I didn't plan on doing this uh, video right now, but uh, I just switched over to uh, my, my beam over here. and uh, <laughs> I don't talk on my beam because I kind of put it up to kind of uh, tune it out work on a little bit not to talk on and I just flipped over to my beam there and uh, just kind of seeing what was going on and uh, seeing the wattage difference of the beam and the ground plane sometimes there's a little difference there I just kind of playing around and I heard that fellow in there and keyed up just for the heck of it and he heard me <laughs> that was pretty neat that's the first person I ever talked to on my beams literally I'm gonna walk over here and show you my beam might be 10 foot off the ground Look at that. That's all it is right there. Ten foot off the ground, all bent up stuff. Got a lot of work need to do on it. That's it right there. Let me get back here and yeah. show this little 1446 driver. It's gonna be driving a 500 Z. Here she is right here. And uh, she's pretty much uh Doing what I need her to do. Gordia. Taking out that 100 watt scale. That's exactly what we need her to do. Dude. That's exactly what we need her to do. So she's a working. Audio. Good deal. Good deal. And I was uh, pretty, pretty good long winded with that fella just then. And uh, cool as a cucumber. I tried some, tried some things a little different this time. I think I like this design. This design isn't showing, uh, well, this configuration isn't showing as much watts. But we're only talking about 10, 15 watts, 20 at the most. But it's staying, staying cooler. It's staying cooler. So I like this design right here. Pretty much hit it a little bit more dry, but it'll do the same as my design I've been doing. Plus, uh, this 1446 is old scrap 1446 also. We'll try something a little different with the variable this time. You take a look at this. That's a 250 ohm variable with 100 ohm 5 watt across it in parallel so they can each share the same wattage. So it turns it to a 7 watt uh, assembly there. Let's see if we can get that a little bit better in the video. There we go. Something a little different there. Thought I'd try it, see how it goes. That's what this is all about, experimenting. <laughs> Been putting these little blue lights on this thing like that right there. Kind of light up the inside there. But uh, there we go. I didn't hook it up to the old MFJ or nothing because I, I already got a couple other one pill videos. So I wasn't even going to make a video for it, but I was doing a... Talk a little skip there, man. Kind of threw me off. <laughs> kind of threw me off for a second, cause yeah, I try to talk on this beam many times, and man, nobody comes back to me about how low it is. But shoot, all right, well here we go, man. Another uh, gatekeeper production. Hey, it's just a hobby, not a business. I just like helping people out and seeing people enjoy enjoy work that I've had my hands in. That's about all it is to it. I dreamed of doing this once I figured it out. Now I am, and I thank God for it. Mr. Gatekeeper, Northeast Georgia, we couldn't go.